Hi, I'm delighted about what I'm about to tell you, and that is that I'm going to be teaching this book. It's called The Spirit of Leadership, and it's by a very good friend of mine who unfortunately was killed in an airplane accident about a year ago, and he's no longer with us, but his name is Dr. Miles Monroe. Now, Miles and I have talked many times together and we have been in many meetings uh, together and I've read a lot of his things that he's written, articles and other books. But when I came across this book, The Spirit of Leadership, um, this is the best book he ever wrote. And it is maybe the top two or three books I have ever read on leadership. It is absolutely excellent. There is gold on every page of this book. Now, I want you to buy this book because I'm going to be teaching from this book. This is my syllabus. It's called The Spirit of Leadership and the Leadership Spirit, a course by my, myself in my series of executive leadership initiatives called Ron Cottle Teaches the Masters. I started this series by teaching one of the books by Watchman Nee, and it was incredibly well received and, and um, I decided that I would start to study more and more after people that I believe are master teachers and master leaders in the body of Christ from whatever generation they come. And when I came across this book by Miles, I said, Miles, my friend, you graduated. This is a great book. So here's the announcement. I will be teaching it July 13, that's 2019, this year. July 13, and uh, it will be held in Columbus, Georgia, here in my home studios. And uh, I have invited 21 people to come because that's how many we can see. And uh, they have said yes. So this is not an invitation to come and be here in the classroom. I can't do that this time, but it is an invitation for you to join us as an online student. And uh, you can do that by contacting us at uh, roncottleministries.com. And uh, Thomas Hale, my right arm administrative, he will uh, sign you up for this course. And we look forward to having you in it. The Spirit of Leadership is the name of the book. That's the title. But the core of the book is what I'm going to do, and I'm going to do it in three hours, by the way. From 9 to 12, um, we will be in, I will reach in and just take the heart right out of the, the, the book itself. And I'm going to contrast the Spirit of Leadership and the Leadership Spirit. Uh, you'll find as you read, uh, buy this book and read it, that that is the core of this book. And um, you can buy this book now, either from Amazon, or you can order it from Whitaker House. W-H-I-T-A-K-E-R, one T, Whitaker House, and that's whitakerhouse.com. Or... You can get it from Bahama, Bahamas Faith Ministries International. That's BFMMM, -M, Bahama Faith Ministries, Miles Monroe.com. BFMMM. -M. That's the website for Miles' ongoing ministry. Now, what are we going to? accomplish with this. The subtitle of this book 
and you may be able even to see that, but probably not, it's in small letters, is cultivating the attitudes that influence human action. Cultivating the attitudes that influence human action. Now, I'm going to do three things. The book attempts these three things. I'm going to attempt it by just taking the seed out, out of the uh, out of the uh, uh, avocado and, uh, and, and give it to you in three, three hours. Number one, define the unique attitudes of all effective leaders. Now, leaders are of all stripes and all kinds and all personalities and all of that sort of thing. Uh, some of them are apostolic, others are prophetic, some are evangelistic, and so on and so on and so on. But they, they all have a certain set of attitudes in common if they are effective. Miles has delineated them so beautifully here, and I want to capture those for us. Secondly, I want to help you eliminate your own leadership abilities by cultivating these in their place. So define unique attitudes of all effective leaders, eliminate hindrances to your leadership abilities, and then finally, fulfill your particular calling in God and in life. That's my objective in this seminar. I hope you will do everything you can to get enrolled and uh, be an online student for it. It's July 13, that's a Saturday morning. We'll go from nine until 12, and I'm gonna give you a two hour, three hour intensive on the spirit of leadership and the leadership spirit. Now they're different, they're different. Everybody's got a spirit of leadership, but not everybody has a leadership spirit. If you can translate the ingredients of the spirit of leadership, which God built into every human being when he said, go and take dominion, be the leader of the world. God even held creation in abeyance Watch this. Now, God built everything. He put it all together. But he waited for Adam to name each species. That is, to bring the order, the cosmos, into God's creation. You and I have that spirit inside of us in Christ, if it has not been eroded by sin. It's in us, in, in Christ. Now we need to cultivate the dimensions of the leadership spirit, the spirit of leadership, into our own leadership spirit, leadership attitudes, in order to become everything God has designed us to be. That's what we're going to do in this seminar. Three hours. Remember, roncottleministries.com. You just go online, roncottleministries.com, and you can register for this seminar. And Dr. Hale will see to it that you get enrolled. I want you to buy the book. That's all you need to do. Buy the book and bring some paper to write on. And you and I will have a great, great time together along with these 21 leaders that I'm going to have, all of these people, strong sons and daughters of God, their questions and answers will enhance the teaching and help us to get all that God has for us in it. So I'll look forward to seeing you then. God bless. Bye-bye.